queen abdication, fears Prince Charles will be king next year, but are they founded? Fears have grown that Prince Charles could be made Prince Regent as soon as next year, but an expert has claimed will shouldn't be worried about the Queen stepping down over health concerns. The Queen, 94, became the longest reigning British monarch in 2015 as she surpassed the reign of her great-great-grandmother Victoria. But after a turbulent start to the year and the coronavirus pandemic, Speculation around whether she will step down has grown. Royal experts are beginning to question whether she will abdicate and pass the throne on to Prince Charles, 71. But royal expert Richard Fitzwilliams does not believe she has any intention of stepping down. Speaking to Express.co.uk, Mr Fitzwilliams said, There have been rumours for years about the possibility of the Queen stepping down or some form of regency. It was announced there would be a four-day bank holiday weekend in the summer of 2021 to commemorate the Queen's Platinum Jubilee. It's worth remembering that in 1947 when she swore to serve her whole life. She's a deeply religious person and she meant every word of it and she's done it absolutely brilliantly. I think she and the Duke of Edinburgh are marvelous role models for persons of advanced age in the case of illness or incapacity that would alter things. I don't think she has any intention of stepping down. It comes as royal editor Robert Jobson explained how the Prince of Wales has been doing a lot of the heavy lifting the past few years as the Queen can't be expected to continue at the same pace. Speaking to Sky News, Mr Jobson said, he is certainly the longest serving heir to the throne. I'm sure he will continue to do so if the Queen wants to continue in that role. I'm sure there is enough scope if she wanted to step aside for him to become Prince Regent and that she can enjoy her retirement like the Duke of Edinburgh has from the age of 96 if she wants to. But otherwise in the Prince of Wales transition over the past 10 to 15 years, he has been taking on more of the responsibilities of the Queen. He does most of the heavy lifting in terms of long-haul flights representing the Queen and is supported by Prince William and the Duchess of Cambridge as well. I think there has been a transition and you can't expect Her Majesty to continue at the same pace as she has the last 86 years.